Today, I'm cooking with Colin Hunter. He's the host of Dex Dogs and Gazebos. I'm gonna take his favorite style of cooking, which happens to be Italian, and I'm gonna make up the panzerito. That's half panzerato, half burrito. Top of it, he happens to be a vegetarian. Got my work cut out for me. So talk to me, vegetarian. Yeah, I've been a vegetarian for 18 years. So you're a lifer, you're in I, it. I'm a lifer. You're you know? in it to win it. We have some ingredients here that are all these are all Italian. Some of it goes in a panzerato, but I'm also gonna wrap it all up in a burrito. So oh. we are inventing the panzerito. What? It's amazing. <laughs> We're gonna put the tortillas in, layer it with polenta, a little bit of the spaghetti, a little tomato sauce. We're gonna add the cheese, the mushrooms, the roasted peppers, the hot peppers, fresh basil, and then we're gonna roll it. it smells amazing, holy smokes. Tomatoes, water, garlic, and butter. Don't judge me, there's butter. No, oh, that's good. It's actually the fastest way to get tomato sauce cream. Take some of the sauce and work it into the pasta. Then we're gonna make a little bit of quick, instant polenta. So what's the trick to polenta? Well, it's kind of something where you can make it exactly to your preference. So if you want it incredibly creamy and a little bit on the thin side, you add less polenta. If you want it a little chunkier, a little thicker, you add more polenta. This mm. is kind of a good space right now. Nice. You're gonna take that brick of Parmesan cheese and mm -hmm. you're gonna just start shaving that into the polenta? Into the polenta. Shave, 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 shave. So we're gonna put the tortillas down. You're gonna grab the polenta, the creamy polenta. Okay. And you just give it, watch your handle, grab a little spoon, make a nice dab on each one. Yeah. That's good? Yeah, sure, and we'll spread it out. Then what we're gonna do is take a little bit of tomato sauce. We're gonna go over the polenta. I feel like I should have a pencil in my ear while we're doing this though, no? It might infringe on my copyright. Yeah, did you invent that look? Is that your look? Oh, uh, my grandpa did. Yeah. yeah. So we're gonna put a little bit of the fettuccine in each one as well. It's fresh, man. It looks so fresh. You like heat too, right? I do. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna put a little spicy pepperoncino in each one. It's just oils and chili peppers. Pocaccini. It's mozzarella cheese. It's a sponge. It just absorbs all the flavors. Bring around a little fresh basil. Fresh basil. And you wanna put uh, some peppers on each one. These are just yep. lightly roasted. Yep. Little oil, salt. Mm -hmm. Same with the, the mushrooms. These are kind of the toppings of your panzerito. So then we're gonna start to fold this thing. So we're gonna make a little half pipe with this. Half pipe, no all about it. Half pipe, fold, and roll. I'm so excited about this, dude. Cheers. It looks amazing. Cheers, Salute. buddy. Best burrito in my life. That's amazing. Is this something you take your job site event? Absolutely. You can wrap up 20 of them probably, put them in the fridge, and then just have them for the week. When we're doing cottages, like people are like, what? You don't eat meat? You don't eat the cow you don't eat beef? Come on. And it's kind of like, well, yeah, I don't eat beef. So this right here is right up my alley. Cool. I like stuff like this. It's nice and fresh. Nobody uh, died in the filming of this <laughs> burrito. 